physical scoring section. VIP bartenders because you didn't complete the moves. And then you, you get deducted as well for your drops. So, we took them out. So, here we go. Nico Valamaki. Okay, perfect. So am I. In three, two, one, let's go. And again, Nico Valamaki is one of those guys that didn't send me any facts about himself. So, medium facts, no facts. The fact that he's from Finland. Yeah, he's from Finland. Any other facts you've got about Nico mm. that you've got he in that wonderful head of yours? He has a signature move with the tongue. With the tongue. I That's think you will witness it in all, a second. All we've got is tongs and the fact he's Norwegian. And I will tell you his stronger hand just in a minute. Oh, when you see his bottle turn. Yeah, ah, okay, he's right. a right. He's a righty. <laughs> and he's a great showman. He is. I'm also mid -air. He's really enjoyable to watch. I always flares with a hat on. I yeah. find it very hard when you, if you're playing with a hat on, doing things. I in your head, never did it. Getting in the way. No. Uh, one of the reasons is the fact I have the biggest head, probably out of all. You do have a big head, so you never see me in the cup like this. Second, the second thing is that you can't really see, you know, some of the objects. Yeah. Uh, you know. I don't understand why. Yeah. Probably he has some move with the head. I believe. Or maybe he has some sponsor who is paying to be there on his head, like with the. Uh, well. What is that? B. B. <laughs> that's, that's a good one. That, that's a good brand name there. I mean, any, other, any brands out there called Burr, get in touch because Tom can advertise you quite well. Ball, sit in there. Okay, moving into with his three bottles, with his restricted view with the peak on his cap. Yep. Oh, unlucky. Bit of a mistake. Oh, there you go. Onto the kiss in the bottom bottle as it goes around. Rafael, Rafael Arce was uh, fantastic at this move. Dangerous. Can really chip your teeth. You can really do yourself a mischief on stuff like that. Okay, working in bottle 10. Uh, hey! Ah, okay. Moving in two teams, one bottle. Lampshade. And it's very cooling. One I wonder how many hours in a day that Tommy Malik actually goes over each post before he actually publishes it. There's definitely a few there. Ooh, nearly a wipeout completely. Nearly takes out the bar. 40 seconds left. Now he's thinking of coming in. Now, here we go. Let's see if he can... Okay, so he's got a shake going on. And again, are we going to see something today about the straining? No use of the strainer. Strains just into the cocktails. There's no flare being done, essentially, here, is it? Like you're saying, there's a 30 to 40 second wait. So it's actually almost 20% of the whole routine. 15. That flare is not being used. Mm. Would be great to have... You know, I'm not saying garnish flare, but as you said, Five, after the shaking, four, with the strainer. Three, two, one. Time, Nico, Benemaki, Finland. Nice team from Nico. Sponsors, bottles on the top. And high fives to all of the judges and cameramen. Why not? Any worse.
Okay. Boom. Have we got some points in our hair? Some points happening? Is that right? Have we got some points coming in? Yeah. Boom. Boom. Mistakes, Lava Better Professional has made better myself. Human mistakes. I ain't no Lava. Hello, Estonia. How's it going? Good to see you here. 